The next generation Ford Endeavor, internationally known as Everest, has been spotted in Thailand ahead of its global debut in 2022. Ford recently confirmed an investment upgrade to its Thailand production facility, which is said to be a hub for production of the new Everest and Ranger pickup truck. Though the spied unit was completely camouflaged, the front end styling of the SUV is still very much visible. Like the previous generation models, this facelift front design also gets inspiration from the 2022 Ranger pickup, which was recently unveiled. The large grille is flanked by C shaped LED. headlamps on both sides reasonably bold strip runs across the grille housing the ford logo at the center which merges the headlamp unit on either side the redesigned bumper also houses a wide air dam as well as a new fog lamp enclosure all these helps in enhancing the muscular looks of the suv on the sides gets a new strong shoulder line but the window line looks quite similar to the outgoing model the suv also gets a massive side step since there is a considerable climb up in the cabin those new alloys also adds enough matching to the muscular silhouette of the SUV while the rear of the car is invisibly clear as the front some previous images reveal a new look with the rear tailgate and LED elements on the tail lamps like the exterior expect similar layout as the Ranger pickup truck's interior receives a large central portrait oriented touchscreen and all digital instrument cluster expect the new Everest to pack in more tech than the current model as well will continue to offer the 2 liter twin turbo eco blue diesel engine from the current model along with likely to get a more powerful 3 liter v6 diesel in the lineup transmission duties will be carried out by a manual and automatic options which include a 10 speed automatic gearbox the exit of ford from india earlier this year meant that indian consumers would miss some promising new launches Although there have been some reports of the SUV reaching the Indian shores as a fully imported model under the CBU route like the Mustang and Mustang Mach-E but it seems not feasible for the local market so what's your thought about the 2022 endeavor does India need one share your thoughts in the comment section below thanks for watching